Here we go again. Uh, get my glasses off. Don't look too nerdy. Uh, I just wanted to make a little video very quickly. Uh, kind of make a. So I got because I only got like very little time. So let's get it done. I am no vlogger. I will not be making a lot of these videos. But I just somehow I I found them. You know I've been a massive uh, card collector when I was a kid and that's pretty much what I did primarily besides anything else I collected toys and I collected comics from the newspaper I had never I was never one of those rich kids that had everything so I you know little ways I found ways to collect things and one of the things that I could get pretty easily was cards because they sold them at the store for nothing they're very cheap and I collected all kinds anywhere I could find them I caught them and I got them I have in my possession everything that I ever collected as a kid and I lost pretty much everything most of the stuff I've collected as a kid has been lost and thrown out Ninja Turtles stuff all that stuff is gone so you know it sucks to lose all that stuff but I'm a very smart when I was when I was a kid I was very smart I put stuff away inside of nooks and crannies in this house so that one day in the future I would actually find it again and I did that into these cards I thought I lost them I don't know if they're gonna be valuable but these are very old cards these are from freaking 1991 I have the official Knight Rider uh, cards I have a couple of those Apparently they turn into a Knight Rider puzzle at the back of them. I have Marvel cards. I have a lot of these cards. And then this book I have a bunch of my old Pokemon cards. I know I, that even that stuff. When I was little I collected Pokemon cards because I figured that stuff would probably be valuable. I collected tons and tons of Marvel cards. I went to, um, I just got a bunch of them one day, uh, when I went to, uh, Salvation Army. They, they were just, there was a bin full of Marvel cards. I collected them, I read them, and, uh, I thought they were very well drawn, you know. Speedball, I mean, who the hell is Speedball? But, I had them, and this book I bought to, to put all the cards in, I remember at the time that I did this, I remember thinking, damn, this book doesn't have enough stuff, you know, I don't have enough pages for all my Marvel cards. This is the point of getting this book, putting my Marvel cards in it. So I then, you know, I used to frequent Dragon's Den and the software, etc. So, I mean, I have, look at this thing. I didn't, this is the modern Marvel, modern Cyclops. In the back, I have the old school Cyclops cards. So these are two cards in one set. And they feature Cyclops in different eras. It's just nuts. And you know, I have baseball cards, some baseball. I had the Batman Forever cards. This is the kind of stuff that cards for movies were made to look like back in the 90s. Look at how exciting this is. Batman climbing a wall. This particular thing is, is how they did cards back then because they didn't shoot anything for cards. So they took something from this movie in some form and just threw it in there. Called it a day. This is this is this is what kind of cards I was able to get for Batman. Commissioner Gordon looking stupid. Law oh, stupid. My favorite card from back then, She Hulk. I found that damn thing. I mean, it's just nuts. Um I just have a bunch of cards. I mean, I look online and I look uh, I look up the old cards that I used to have when I went into the Air Force for a bit there. I lost my Donatello card from this very collection. I brought it with me for good luck. This is the kind of crap... Oh man, my Batman Returns cards were always ripped up. Whenever, whenever I, when I got these cards... Look, look what I'm talking about. This is a, 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 a terrible, terrible idea for a card. It's Batman in the middle of a stunt on set, and, and that's the card they came up with. It's terrible. We got Tim Burton. So a lot of these cards feature behind-the-scenes stuff. That's essentially what they are. Uh, and that's, you know, that's the reason you get them. 
I have the Power Rangers the movie cards. This was the life I lived, man. I was a 90s kid, and if you were growing up in the 90s, you got the Power Rangers the movie toys from McDonald's, and you got the cards. You got the Daredevil card here. I did not expect at all to find this collection of baseball cards and, and basketball cards and Batman cards. There's just a little Michael Keaton Batman thing going on here. This was what life was like in the 90s. You were having yourself a Nala. I remember when Lion King came out, we, we, we got the cards and we got the toys from, from, from McDonald's. and Or was it Burger King and then Glow in the Dark? And it was a sweet time to be a Lion King fan. Oh, we, I saw Lion King at the movies with my friend at his birthday party. You know, it's like it was an event. So I really had a good time back then going to see Lion King. I had to laminate this one because it's a really good picture. So I, I laminated the Batman card. I don't have much time left. I got the old. I have the Olympic. This is a thick card because it's. I, this is a really a badass one. This is the original Shaquille O'Neal uh, Olympic card when he was playing in the Olympics. I was alive back then, my friends. I was there when Michael Jordan and everybody was going into the Olympics and playing. So. I had the opportunity to buy the Michael Jordan last shot card. Everybody calls it the uh, the, the first last shot card because, it, yeah, it wasn't his last shot. So they, they, they oh, I got the Reggie Miller card. This might be valuable. I don't know. I don't know what the value is of these things, but I had them in my possession, and I just kept them, and I, I laminated them nicely enough, and I called it a day. This is some applesauce lid from back in the 90s, most likely. Here you go. This is some classic applesauce lid. <laughs> Everything 90s in my house here. Look, Iron Man. God damn. I like these glowy ones. Divine, right? This is a, this is the kind of cards they had back then, man. Some cool stuff. All right, I'm over the limit. This is what I'll do. I look at, like at cool stuff and uh, hope you get a kick out of it. I'm going to put this up on YouTube now. Uh, Jim Carrey, caffeine, oh, kill ya! <laughs>